Hi. And we are again. We need to watch some more Ghost of Tsushima. Let's just make sure that I am actually live before I do say anything. Just want to acknowledge that I'm actually live? Hey, Twitch. Dig it. Okay, yeah, we are. All right. Hello, everybody. You ready to experience some more Ghost of Tsushima? Part two already. Now, okay, so I have done a little bit of work. Um, not a major amount. Like, like we're talking. Like, I, I've not done any story-related stuff, but I did grab some things. So I did grab the charm of Anari from doing uh, the uh, which which one was it the um, the Arrow Peak Shrine because that is probably the best charm I can get early game. It increases supplies, predator hides, bamboo, and yew wood collect gained from collecting. And that's going to be really important because I'm going to want to upgrade all my stuff really quickly. I can already upgrade my Sakai Katana. Um, I actually have a lot of supplies. Holy fucking shit. But I only have enough to upgrade... Oh no, I do have enough to upgrade the sword and the Tanto once... And it looks like I have enough to upgrade the Traveler's Attire. Can I upgrade the bow, though? Probably. But yes. So, yes, I I did some... I basically made some progress towards um, getting my new stances, which is Wind Stance. So I need to kill five more leaders. Um, and then I also got... Um, an upgrade for each, and I also got uh, fart and stealth hearing, as well as I think you saw me get stealth landing. But yeah, um, I think I also have enough for a arrow capacity. No, I'm almost there with a an uh, arrow capacity upgrade. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to the golden temple, and it's gonna be really fucking fun. <laughs> Holy shit! Okay, so one of the things about ghost is that. Periodically, you can actually go to a shrine to this fellow here. Lord Sakai! It's good to see you. Gonjiro, right? You yes. served to Lord Nagao. Lord yeah. He's a good man. I'm sorry we lost him. I'm honored you recall a humble household servant. So many of us here owe you our lives. I'm afraid the fight for our home is just beginning. That's why we want to help, my lord. People started donating what they could, and... Please, accept these gifts. Thank you, Honjiro. And everyone else who contributed. We'll keep donating what we can, here and elsewhere, as word of your victory spread. May the Kami keep you from harm. So yeah, you can pick up gifts from these gift altars in special settlements. So I got the Glowering Warrior. As well as ten linen, ten iron, ten bamboo, and that's it. Just some crafting materials this time. Uh, we also did get the mask, which was uh, the glowing warrior. Do you know what? I'll wear that one. My lord, you made it. I came straight here. Stayed off the roads. Just like you said, Lord Sakai. I'm glad you got here safely. Oh! How is your little one holding up? He's braver than his father. People didn't believe it when I told them a samurai sent us here. Take care of yourself. And the little one. The people here don't have much to offer. But we'll do everything we can to help. Man. A year on, and this game still continues to amaze me. Alright. So, there are various vendors here. So there's, as you, you can actually tell based on a settlement, what is here. So we have a gift altar, a bowyer, a swordsmith, and an armorer. 
Um, so the so the bow you. All right, let's chat to the swordsmith. Upgrade the Sakai Katana. Good. And the Tanto. So the Tanto only has three upgrades. So we need 300 supplies and 70 iron. I think I might actually invest in the Tanto first. Because being able to kill enemies faster by just upgrading the Sakai Tanto would be much more beneficial than... Yeah. So the Traveler's Attire doesn't do much, but it will increase the Fog of War. So this could be an option, but I'm actually going to invest more in the bow first. Also, this is the Legend Story, Taylor. This is Gyozen. He is the protect or the main sort of character in the Legends game mode, which is the the multiplayer that they added for this game for free. He's voiced by this. He is the voice actor for Uncle Iroh in the modern Avatar. Like obviously, Marco isn't able to do it because God rest his soul. Okay, let's upgrade the half bow. Death from afar. Death from afar, indeed. Okay, so that's pretty much all the upgrades you can do. I'm not going to do the armorer one, uh, simply because, like, I don't need to... Up I could upgrade the Traveler's Attire, but I want to invest more in the Sakai Katana. But I need more iron and steel for that. And then for the Tanto, I need... Yeah, I just need more thingy. So, I think now we can start with the Tale of Lady Masako. Which will give us a massive legend increase. Uh, she is not where I expected her to be. I thought she'd be at the temple. Now, I did also unlock some fox dens and various other stuff on the map. Um, as you can see here, there's a fox den. I think there's also a haiku somewhere knocking around. Um, also a tori gate. Um, I have not done them. Because I want my girlfriend to help them help me with them, so um, yeah, that is my reasoning. So we are going to go over to Lady Masako's um, thing. So we need to travel to the Adachi Estate. I wish I could show you this, like, at daytime, because, holy shit, the Golden Forest looks amazing. Actually, do you know what? Nah, actually. So yeah, you see how I get extra um, bamboo every time I gather? That's the charm of Inari doing the good work. All right, here's the Adachi estate. This will be important for later. Clan Adachi's estate. Lady Masako should be here. Lady Masako! Warriors of Clan Adachi! Is anyone here? Oh my god. So yeah, I get 15 supplies from that. It doubles it. To, well, it gives me 17. Leather. That's going to be quite an important one. Ah! Where's Lady Masako? Tell me where she is. Who are these men? Not Mongols. And not bandits. I need to find out what happened here. Oh, the sun's rising. Oh, this game never ceases to amaze me. Okay. Okay. Someone forced their way in. A Naginata. Used by the women of Clan Adachi. They fought to defend their family. Hmm. 
trying to escape past the children through the window. A Naginata. It's a pole weapon. They may have fled on horseback. Better check the stables. A pole weapon. One of the several varieties of traditionally made Japanese blades, or Nihonto. Naginata were originally used by the samurai class, as well as the Ashigaru, which are foot soldiers, and Sohei, warrior monks. The Naginata is an iconic weapon of the Onabushigesha, or Bugesha, a type of female warrior belonging to the Japanese nobility. So, yeah, checks out. If it wasn't obvious by now, um, Sucker Punch did their homework with this game. They really, really did. Empty stables. Someone Inches. took the horses. Horse tracks. Someone fled the estate. They left a trail. Okay. Arrowheads. Arrowheads and blood. Archers what? are hunting the rider. Lots of arrows. Skilled. Knew how to confuse their aim. Damn. And the horse Found didn't horse. make it. F. This horse belonged to Clan Adachi. Dead for days. Do Lady Muzical, it's me. Jean Sakai. They said no samurai escaped Komoda. My husband. Lord Adachi died a warrior's death. No, he fucking didn't. Defending our home. He was brutalized. Jin, don't lie to the woman. Why have you come? The Mongol Khan has captured Lord Shimra. If your clan joins me, what I'm clan? My uncle. And avenge your men. Clan Adachi is dead. Massacred by our own people. Traitors. Why would they kill those who swore to protect them? I intend to find out. I'm coming with you. No. Do not set aside your concerns for mine. The family of samurai are my concern. I know what it means to be the last of one's clan. I cannot be responsible for your death. You won't be. Ride with me. Oh, she changed her tune. The tale of Lady Masako. Hot men at your estate. They were waiting to finish what they started. The night my husband and sons rode to face the Mongols. I hear a fox then. The assassins came to our home. My sister took the children and fled. I stayed with my son's wives to fight our attackers. We were outnumbered. And then I was the only one left. That's how it ended for me at Komoda. For me. It wasn't over. I buried them here, with the rest of our family. I tried to save them, but the assassins caught them on the road. Cut them down. My sister, my grandchildren, even little Natsu. She was just born. 
All I could do was bury her with her mother. This never should have happened. My sister should have been buried with her husband in the north. But at least she's with family. Ride for the Golden Temple. We just came from there. Sorry you endured this alone. I am not alone. The killers are alive. They will pay for what they did. Every moment the killers walk free brings me shame. You can't blame yourself. But it is my duty to punish them for it. And so it shall be. You'll have to go in without me. Find the monk named Sogen and tell him the fate of Clan Adachi. What are you plotting, Lady Masako? Indulge a grieving widow. Once you've talked to Sogen, find the armorer. She is repairing something for me. I want you to have it. I will do that. Thank you. I will wait for you on the other side of the temple. All right, here we go. Lord Sakai, it is Hello. an honor. Are you in charge here? I think of myself as more of a servant, my lord. Please. Call me Junshin. I made this temple a haven for our people. I'll spread the word. If they cannot make the journey, there are also camps around Ariake. I supply them with all the food I can spare. That's good to know. I'm looking for one of your fellow monks, a man named Sogen. I believe he is sweeping the temple deck. Thank you, Junshin. Continue your good work. There he is. Are you Sogen? I am. I am Sakai. A samurai. Alive? I have a message from Lady Masako. Clan Adachi was attacked. She is the only survivor. The Mongols. Traitors. Our own people. How horrible. Has anyone suspicious passed through the temple? A group of armed men? Not that I've seen, but... My duties keep me far too busy. Please tell Lady Masako she's welcome to take refuge here. Mm. Thank you for your time. Of course. When the monk is sus. I feel like he knows something. I can't imagine being the only samurai left alone against an army. He's not alone. There's a woman helping. What good is that? Stopping and listening is interesting. Your armor fitting, my lord. Lady Masako sent me. Said you were repairing something she wanted me to have. The armor. It's one of the finest sets I've ever worked with. Let me get it. The samurai clan armor. Sturdy armor that once begun long to a son of Perfectly, my lord. The quality is incomparable. It will serve you well, but if anything isn't to your liking. I can always make alterations. All I need are the right materials. Thank you. So, armor loadouts. So, this will reduce all damage by a moderate amount 
a moderate increase to health, and taking damage will grant resolve. And this actually might be worth upgrading, but for now. And I'm going to switch this to the Storm of Clan Sakai. Just because I like it. Oh no, Lady Massacre. You got the armor. I did. It fits well. It belonged to my eldest, Shigesato. It is an honor. I spoke to the monk. What did Sogen say? He offers you refuge in the temple. So my family's killers know where to find me. We need to move. You think Sogan is behind the massacre? He visited my home just before the assassins. The little bastard was their scout. That doesn't prove his guilt. No, but it earns my suspicion. Sogan arrived from Kami Agata at the beginning of autumn. When we first heard the Mongols plan to invade. The plot to destroy my clan took precision, planning. And a war to cover the treachery. Hmm. Where is that monk? There's Sogan, leaving in a hurry. Let's follow the wolf to his den. We can get down here. Now, because of my new damn peasants, it's not what I'd say. You sent me to frighten the monk. I knew he would panic, make a mistake. Now he's leading us to his friends. Stay close. We can't be seen. Thanks to this new fast or stealth breathe, stealth hearing, I, I can move. I can move, Kai. Buck. Do you see us? I don't think so. He's moving again. Let's go. <laughs> Don't mind me. See you. Let's get closer. Masako's alive. She has a samurai with her. Mm. That must be who killed our men at the estate. You fools. Now they know I'm part of this. You have to find them. Keep your voice down. I'm going inside. Don't come back until they're dead. Those men slaughtered my family. Spare the monk. The rest can die. Right. Stand and fight! This you ready, boys? It certainly will. 
Okay, let's let's just do one quick thing. Oh no, 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 no. Need shit, hold on. There's nowhere to run, Sogan. You destroyed Clan Adachi. I was only a messenger. For who? Knowledge does not end suffering. You know nothing of suffering. Masako. I buried my family, one by one. It took days. But I'm going to leave you for the wolves. We need him alive to tell us who he serves. Our world has changed. Men of vision must rise to face it. And those in the way must be removed. They were children! <laughs> Masako! No, I'm with Masako. He fucking deserved that. He, he was never going to talk. We still need information. There has to be something we can use. Search outside. I'll deal with things in here. Find me when you're done. Jesus. Slaughtering children is that all their lives were worth? That's where you keep your payment. Names: Sogan, Sadao, Mai, Kajiwara, Omura. Masako might know them. Why would you fucking write down your conspirators? That's so stupid. Okay, all right. Find anything? Yeah. What of it? A list of names and a clan symbol. I found the same symbol on these men. I've never seen it before. A rival clan moving in to take control. We have to stop them. I will. You cannot do it alone. When my uncle hears of this, he will not rest until the traitors pay for what they did. Help me, and we will bring down everyone who hurt you. Together. When you need help rescuing your uncle, I will be there. Thank you, Lady Masako. Until that time, I have work to do. All right. You're a good horse, Noble. You are. Well, Lady Masako is now recruited. And with that, we go from the wandering samurai to the people's hope. And we can have a new ghost weapon. Now we actually get to choose. Um.
I'm gonna go with the smoke Incense bomb. Mixed with black powder creates thick smoke. Enough to blind my enemies. And we can use blinding dust. I think I'm gonna hold off. Quick fire weapon swapping. So you can switch ghost weapons between the kunai and the smoke brom by do using the d-pad. And that changes your stance. Okay. So. We can carry on with Lady Masako's story. Which will give us a minor utility charm. There's also a... Hmm... Blood on the Grass, and the Broken Blacksmith. I think we're going to go this way. Well, actually, no, I'm going to go to Komatsu Forge first. I'll go via Komatsu. And we just get to take in the sights. I don't have any arrows! No! Piggy! Piggy! Ah! There we go. <laughs> I need more arrows. Oh. I mean, there's gotta be some here. As we were. Nothing. Komatsu Prefecture. And suddenly the weather turns shit. Susano, protect me. Killed these people. A fearsome warrior. He demanded I tell him the tale of Shigenori's heavenly strike. When he didn't hear the answers he sought, he flew into a rage and butchered them. What did he want to know? I am not sure, my lord. Tell me the story. I need to know what he's after. When Tsushima was first set on, a strange and terrible thunderstorm swept across our island. Wherever lightning struck, beasts of lightning appeared. These violent creatures 
tore through villages, causing death and destruction, moving too quickly to be stopped. The people knew only one man who could possibly stand against the lightning beasts. Shigenori, the fastest swordsman in all of Tsushima. Shigenori never lost a duel. With years of practice, he had created the Heavenly Strike, an attack that struck quicker than the eye could follow. Shigenori lured the creatures to a desolate beach in Komatsu, where the sand would slow their movement. Their clash turned the sand to ash and bleached the leaves of trees white. Shigenori's heavenly strike cut through them faster than they could move. As the final beast fell, the storm cleared and Tsushima was safe again. Shigenori began a life of seclusion. Few students found him, and only the bravest and most skilled proved worthy of learning the heavenly strike. When a storm approaches, a sword is placed at Shigenori's rest by a student who knows of its location to ward off attacks from beasts of nature. Nodoro wishes to learn Shigenori's heavenly strike. It sounds dangerous in the wrong hands. Which way did he go? A woman fled toward a nearby bridge. He chased her. He'll answer for what he did here. This is a legendary t tale. I'm not going to be doing this right now. I'll carry this on later. But you can find the storyteller in various places around Tsushima. And he can teach you legendary techniques. That's the bridge the musician mentioned. Or the musician, and he will. There are special things that you can do. Uh, I will be going for all of the legendary, the legendary tales, but just not right now. Midas Komatsu Forge. We're not going to be clearing this out just yet. We're going to be heading here. We're going to be going to do blood on the grass. Oh, we gotta do a fox den, I mean... So my girlfriend can watch. She loves her foxes. And looks like the half bow can now be upgraded thanks to the yew wood I collected. I'd honestly love to go to a fox sanctuary. Where you going, bud? Where are we going, bud? Ooh, this is a hidden one. Thank you, friend.
All right. We head out here. Oh yeah. Okay, I've got two technique points. I'm going to use it to get... That's what I want. That's what I want. Unyielding spear parry. Soon. Because once I can deal with these fucking spear boys... Where are we going? Oh, the Komatsu Haiku. Wow, that's a good spot. Interesting. I don't. Th I think I'm backing the wrong he horse here. I think I should just get myself to not here. caught me with surprise. Singing crickets! These could be used to learn new songs for your flute. I haven't mentioned the flute much because you know, it's not really... Oh, hello. Hey. It's a bad guy in the old. 
There's a lot of these boys. Okay, see ya. I can now block arrow shots, which is going to be really important for people not to get an upper hand on me. Um, yeah. Okay, so which way are we going? This way. Again, I don't think I'm supposed to be going here yet. I feel like that's a... Uh... Sutsu Prefecture. Ooh. Huh. Come on, birdie. Another haiku spot. Ohama Fishing Village. We're still not there. Survivor camp. My lord, anything to offer from your hunting? Let's have a chat with the uh... worthy of a samurai. It's a good upgrade. Here we are. We made it. Grasslands. Straw hat mercenaries were seen in the area. Too much smoke for Mongo convoy ambushed. Could be the straw hats doing. Attack started here, but there had to be more than one Mongol. Mm. 
blood on the grass. Looks like more bodies up ahead. His attackers. I really want to switch to Kurosawa mode just for this. Yuzo. You look like a scarecrow. You look better too. <laughs> Can I have my hat? You're a mercenary now. Professional warrior. Maybe you can help me. I'm looking for your leader. He died on Komoda Beach. You were there too. I lost a lot of friends. We all did. And we can avenge them, if we work together. Help me save Lord Shimura. He is alive. The straw hats are hurt. Starving. I can't ask them to risk their lives for one man. Even if you can name your price? Once we free our home, Lord Shimura will pay you anything you want. My men might be interested. Your men? I look out for them. Someone has to. Do we have a deal? I'll think about it. Hold your ground. I always do. Here we go. This is for Komoda Beach. Kill them all. We're not out yet, we are not out yet, we are not out yet. Oh, 
We got him. Whew. The straw hats can't save your uncle. We'll be lucky if we survive the week. It's that bad? We're starving. I was out here hunting for food. And I'm returning to my men empty-handed. <laughs> but not alone. Take me to your camp. We'll figure something out on the road. <laughs> Just like old times. Uh, you're doing great. Planning to walk? I am not letting all these supplies. When was the last time we saw each other? Forgive me, Ryuzo. I looked for you after the tournament ended. Straw Hat saw our duel. They needed a new sword. It seemed like fun. You never visited my uncle's castle. There wasn't work there. I would have helped you become a retainer of Clan Shimura. You only had to ask. I made my own way. Wow. Another Holy might, shit. Might have something we can salvage. Empty. Samurai! Samurai! Was this your wagon? Yes, my lord. Mongols stole my horse, took my rice. You're lucky that's all you lost. Which way did the Mongols go? Toward Fort Ohira. Damn it. Take refuge at the Golden Temple. Warn others to stay off these roads. Yes, my lord. Let's keep moving. My camp's not far. I meant what I said before. Help free Lord Shimura, and he'll grant you anything in his power. What's he got the power to give? He can declare the Straw Hearts a samurai clan, and make you their lord. On an island, conquered by Mongols. We will drive them out. Your name will appear in the Shogun's official records. You really believe that? I believe it's worth fighting for. I've always been a dreamer. It can't have been easy keeping the Straw Hats together after Kumula Beach. How did you do it? I convinced them nobody can save us but ourselves. That's true. I used to think so. It is starting to feel like a lie. How many men do you have? We're down by half, but still enough to call ourselves a small army. Why? That peasant said the Mongols stole his rice and went to Fort Ohira. You think they're hoarding food there? Possibly. Do you have an idea? The beginning of one. Easy, Shinzo. It's me. He's here! Ryuzo's back! I don't see any food. Who's the samurai? Men! This is my old friend, Lord Sakai. Ryuzo told me you're starving. I'm here to help. You didn't find food. We have a plan. Raid Fort Ohira and take back the food Mongols have stolen from our people. Raid a fort? They'll kill us! Give us a moment. Come with me, Jin. We should have talked about your idea before telling my men. I wanted to give them hope. That's my job. I meant no disrespect. It's fine. Through here, Jin. If you ride with the straw hats, you have to look the part. I've got a spare set of armor that should fit. You'd better not have lice. Never letting me forget that, are you? Spare armor's in the chest. You're not as handsome as me, but it's not bad. <laughs> we should check the fort's defenses. God, why is that, that Jingasa? My men will handle that fort. <clears throat> then we have a deal? It looks so scraggly. Get us that food at the fort of Ohira. And we'll get your uncle away from the Mongols. Thank you, Yuzo. Just 
Remember who's in charge of the straw hats. I would never dream of replacing you, my friend. Give us a head start. We'll meet you at the old cemetery. Mm. See you there. Blood on the grass. There we go. Another tech point. So that's the next story, the tale of Ryuzo, but I want to get to, uh, I want to get to that, so mythic tales are now available, that's what those are. Should be able to make it. Just take this all in. A logging base? Well, if you insist. So kill an enemy while concealed by a smoke bomb. So running the tire reduces detection speed after leaving pampas grass while crouched. Enemies will be much slower to detect you. It is not so. so this is a very densely packed enemy encampment. Probably denser than anything we've seen thus far. But... It's still quite slow on the uptake of that. One thing I do want to find is I want to find the, the boss. I want to find the boss and I want to be able to observe him. Because observing counts as a second... Where do you see me? You didn't see me. Observing a, a camp, like... Um, leader classifies as also killing him. Oh, great lord, this is going to be really dicey. Whoop. Whoop. How many are there? Whoop. 
one. You. Deal with you first. Don't make too much noise, don't make too much noise. Stay quiet, shush. There we go. Alright. So we do need to still kill an enemy concealed as while concealed by a smoke bomb. So that's something we've also got to consider. I think that's him. Eliminate the camp poor general. That's the Sashimono banner. So where's the general then? I just don't trust the- I just don't trust the half-bow. Oh boy. Now we're in trouble. There he is. This is the war general, but... Oh, great lord. So here's the problem. Biggie Smalls over here doesn't want to come out of his tent. Any way I take these guys, it's going to be... Shit! Hmm. Where did he see me? Who sees me? Oh, that was a shot! Alright, down. Right! Let's skip the welcoming committee! All right, here we go. Okay, so we can't go in loud. We cannot go in loud. There's way too many enemies. I feel like we're, we're punching way above our weight here. Stagger swordsmen with stone stance heavy attacks. Wait, so, I, so this wants me... So this wants me to go in loud now. Right, I need to get to the yurt. Big boy's yurt. Huh? Where is he? Is that him? <sighs> you didn't see anything. Then next. Oh, no. 
And the leader's dead. I wanted to observe him, but mm, that was proving difficult. Records. Ho. Amazingly, these guys didn't see that. I kill the guy, but then these guys fucking get me, because I have the fucking... I have the durability of a wet tissue. Alright. Alright, loud we go. Just in case. Hello. Yeah, well. Let's at least whittle away some of the wo the force. Ooh. You. Okay, right, up we go. Got him! Hello! Hi! Okay, damn. All right, we were, mm. all right. We keep trying. We keep trying. I've spent fifteen minutes at this so far. I'll be honest with you. You don't actually need to do all the legend challenges to constitute to like get all the like to get to max level you don't you don't need it are there any animals no doesn't look like it I've been through all here right what's left Oh, okay. We're gonna grab that, are we, Jin? But not that! Pick a lane!
Oh, no, no, no. Oh, we got a smoke bomb. Nice. You really want to play this game with me, fucko? Okay. Okay, you... Come on. Calm down. Fuck me yourself, you coward. Right, let's grab that Sashimono banner. Swordsman! What am I doing? Hello! Sorry, I'm just playing my food now. Sorry, I just like having fun bullying them. Hello. Right, where's the black powder cache? I know I saw her around here somewhere. Have to keep on causing violence, isn't so? Where is it? Why didn't you tell me where it was? Knock. <laughs> no. Oh, there it is. Actually walked past him.
There we are. That's another logging camp dealt with. We've got an extra technique point. I mean, I've got three of them now. Terrifying parry. Hmm. These ones aren't as great. Um. We're going to get Iron Will. Did I get wait? I should have gotten I should have gotten resolve parry. God damn it. Oh, oh well. Ah, alright. Let's get on the road again. What matters is we got a new ability. Which is we can now parry those spear guys. Which is gonna be a big deal. That was a scared sake merchant trying to wriggle out of trouble. And it worked! I offloaded that sour rice water and you... Had to look over my shoulder. For a month. You're paranoid. You owe me, Kenji. <sighs> Taka's counting on us. I love the kid, but this is too dangerous. It will never work. We'll make it work. This the samurai? You can call me Lord Sakai. Forgive me, my lord. I am Kenji, upstanding merchant, renowned sake brewer, and the best swindler on the island. That's why he's going to help us rescue my brother from Azamo Bay. That town's a fortress. If the Mongols took it, we'll need an army to penetrate the walls. Or a single delivery of sake. <laughs> It'll never work. Get your sake ready. We'll discuss the plan on the move. Let's have a drink first. Talk this through. Now, Kenji. The Broken Blacksmith. When we get close to the town, you can hide in the cart with a sake. The Mongols won't search it? Not anymore. It's the same sake delivery I always sell them. They love my Dars. Dars, Mughal, give a Dars now! You've been doing business with the enemy. I keep the Mongols drunk, and they let me keep my head. He's got a point. Oh, sir. You sure you want to go through with this? Anything for Taka. How bad is the occupation in Azlomo Bay? A few people fought back. The ones left alive are prisoners or slaves. But you never saw Taka? No. But someone's been working the forge the past few days. Maybe it's your brother. How long have you two known each other? Since I was too young to know better. I was just starting to brew sake. So do you know my first batch? Huh. Tasted like piss, but it was cheap. For a while, I tried to get Taka's help selling it. Turned out he was too soft. People told him sob stories, and he'd give them sake, free of charge. Mongols. Damn, you two better get in the cart. There aren't many. I can handle them. No, Jin. Taka is so close. Please. All right. Mm. Search the car. You said they don't do that. The town gates? I've never seen them this far out here. My hand. Please, give me a point. Dars! Dars for Azamo Bay! Aha! Dars! Hurry up! 
Just a little farther. What was all that screaming? Doesn't matter. Keep it down. Is that what Taka's going through? Your brother's a skilled blacksmith. They won't treat him like that. You don't know that. Mm. Asimo Bay. We're in. I can't believe this worked. Oh no. Somebody must have pissed off the Mongols. They burned half the town. What a mess. This is where we part ways. Keep the Mongols drunk and distracted. I'll do my best. Stay safe, Kenji. And you. Lord Sakai. Mm. Taka's waiting for us. Let's go. Once we're done, I'll meet you at the crossroads. Behind town. We need a vantage point to scout ahead. This way. Remember, no alarms. We do this quietly. All the prisoners suffer. Got it. He's in charge. A slaver. Bastard. He's inspecting the prisoners like they're horses. He might lead us to Taka. Follow him. Chiharu! <laughs> Yasunbe! Damn it. God, this place is fucking Fuck. Shit. This is gonna put me. Okay. All that because I missed a fucking jump.
What is his problem? Your blacksmith, Taka. His work is shoddy. I think he's sabotaging you. I know it. Taka's here. He is only blacksmith. No, I'm a blacksmith too. And I'll do much better work. I cannot be too. I get rid of him. But be ready to prove yourself. That bastard. He'll kill Taka. Stay close, you know. I'll find a way through. You will torch me to show. Oh my god, it's crawling with them. <sighs> I need to get up. Here we go. The slaver. Can't let him get away. Ah. Uh. Which was which? He in the ha. Not a thunder from us. This is Lord Sakai. He'll protect us. I need you to trust me, Tucker. I need your help. I'll try, my lord. What exactly did they do to him? Okay. There's a gate nearby. Then that's where we break out. They found the slaver. They'll kill us. We need to hide. No, keep moving. We can climb those crates. Oh. Where are we going? Kenji's waiting for us at a crossroads. Kenji's with you? If he made it out alive.
Oh boy. Are you cowards? Dirty, dirty tricks, but they worked. Stay down. It's Kenji! Taka! You made it! Were you followed? No, but we can't go back to my place. It's crawling with Mongols. We should go. We have to put some distance between us and Azamo Bay. Alright, let's go then. Haven't seen a Mongol since dawn. I think we're clear. We need to figure out where to go next. There's a place up ahead where you can see most of Izuhara. Everyone all right? I could use a drink and some sleep. I can help with one of those. Taka, you've been quiet. First time in days, I haven't felt like I was about to die. My lord, I am grateful. But how do you know Kenji and my sister? I owe Yuna my life. <laughs> we have something in common. <sighs> I'm not built for riding all night. Matsu is just over that bridge. Kenji, you're not built for anything. They have a forge. One of the best on the island. A good place to make tools. Maybe something to get gin over the walls of Castle Canada. What do you say, Taka? My lord, I'll do anything to repay you for freeing me. Thank you. Taka, Kenji, get some rest. We can't stay here long. How are you doing? I have my brother back. He's shaken up. Can you get him to Komatsu in one piece? With food and rest, he'll be fine. Your brother wasn't the only prisoner in Azamo Bay. You're going to save them. And make their captors suffer. Good. Right for Komatsu Forge. I'll join you when I can. Jin? Thank you. Here we are. That's Taka. And we rank up once again. The unyielding wind. All that health we got. Wow. Time for a new ghost weapon. We've had two quick fires, so I think it's time to use the black powder bomb. If I pack the Mongols' black powder into a clay pot, I can set it aflame and throw it as a weapon.
So I can now switch between ranged weapons. The half bow and the shrine weapon. But yeah, so the next thing to do will be to probably... Nope. So, unfinished business. So that would have us clearing out Azamo Bay. Tale of Kenji. And this will take us to Komatsu Forge. This will do Ryuzo's story. And yeah. Still a lot to do. Still definitely a lot to do. And so little time. But I think that will be saved for another episode. So thank you very much for watching. I'm going to do some messing around in between episodes. Like upgrading the Sakai Katana and maybe the Tanto. Are we going to do the Tanto if I'm being honest? Um, and from there, well, who knows? We will, uh, we will see. We will definitely see indeed. So, thank you very much for watching, and uh, I'll see you for the next episode of Ghost of Tsushima.